simple steak and potatoes if I'm on a budget, pandemic kicking our butt, but I want to show my significant other that I appreciate them. How could I whip that up? All right, so me, potatoes is like cheap for you. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? You're lucky. And steak has an original price, but we're straight. Okay, okay. Um, I like that. Welcome to another episode of Shapely TV. <laughs> this is our B Day episode, and we have a special guest. We have Chef Rox. Tell everybody who you are, where you're from, and what you do. Uh, so my name is Chef Rox. Everybody just call me Rox. Most people call me Teddy. You don't know the matter. But I'm a chef based out of Queens. I'm homegrown. Everything I do is homegrown. Oh, it's all self-taught. So yeah, that's kind of what I do. You know, I do with that way everywhere. I do Caribbean, soul food, Latin, and everything except for aviation. I haven't hit them yet. I'm going there, so worry about it. Okay. <laughs> and where can people find you? You can find me on Instagram at underscore R U X P I N. And maybe you can also find my food page, which is Rux Comforts. It's R U X Comforts. Either page you can find me on your name. I didn't even know about the food page. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know. Okay. <laughs> Most people okay. just go to the regular right. you know, okay. Instagram. I got some learning to do, clearly. Okay. So, we have a drinking game that we play. So, every time we choose a word, and every time the user hears that word, if they're 21 and only if they're 21, they take a shot. Okay, so the word of the episode is going to be cooked. Let's talk about Valentine's Day, right? Coming up, COVID is still in full swing. Some people might not be going out to dine. Some people may be staying in, right? So I figured you'd be the perfect guest to discuss how we can take one meal, right, and make it affordable. Some of us are out of work. Some of us, you know, things are, funds are tight. So if we want to cook for our bay as opposed to going out, how can we do it more so on the low end and then what we can do to kick it up a notch? So a, a classic for me is like steak and potatoes, right? Unless you're a vegetarian, you really can't go wrong with steak and potatoes, right? Yeah, you can't go wrong with steak and potatoes. You Unless you can't. overcook. That's what you go <laughs> So the well done people, ugh. Not a well I'm a medium. I'll do medium, medium well. Okay. I won't do rare, though. I can't don't, do rare. Don't finish my steak. Please. Oh, yeah. And I learned that pretty late in life. Like, I think I first tasted a medium steak, and I was like, what have I been missing my whole life? It's a lot of flavor that steak. Yes. Man. You know what I'm saying? You let it meet the rest of your units. Yes. Yeah. So mm -hmm. that eight minutes. That, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it, it does. It does. It does its job. So let's talk about the importance of letting meat rest, right? Yeah. I'm not a, I'm not saying let's scorch it out food. I don't understand how people just be like, I'm gonna cook it and then they go straight for the uh -huh. like, you know, blood, you know us. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Nice. <laughs> you know, you know, we do that. <laughs> for some reason, I don't I don't, I don't like that so uh -huh. hot textures touching the roof. Right. Out. Yeah, just no. I just let it relax, let it chill, and then eat. You know right. what I'm and yeah. it, it, everything cooks on its own for the next few minutes. Yes. You know what I'm saying? So Leave your food alone. They just then let them juices reabsorb. Ooh, the holidays, the grab turn. But anyway, not we're, going there. we're that grassy, exactly. Okay. So simple steak and potatoes. If I'm on a budget, pandemic kicking our butt, but I want to show my significant other that uh, I appreciate them. How could I whip that up? All right. So me, potatoes is like cheap for you. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? You're lucky. And steak has an original price. Straight. You okay. Okay. Um, I like mash. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Like, most potatoes are great, but I like mash. Okay. You know what you're doing? Put the perfect mashed potato. As far as the steak, if you want it to be all fancy and cute looking, what you do is, right, you lay it the rest, and then you cut it. And then you lay on top of the steak where it's, like, it's just like a wide bed on it. You go right there. You're great. It's like you, you chef it up your own self. You go to Ramsey for the day, you know what I'm saying? Because <laughs> you can't go wrong right there. Right. Just, the most you'll spend, if you're working on a budget for real, and you don't want to go outside, like you really don't want to go, 
excuse me for plugging, download this car. The best thing, save my life, the whole bit. Our other co host yeah. is not here, Toya. Huge fan of Instacart. Tell me what? Huge fan. I've never used it. Huge it's like it's the Uber Eats of most of the really? You don't do nothing. Okay. You just. <laughs> and he's like, and then if the person who's taking care of your order needs help, they'll text you on the Instacart app. Like, hey, oh yeah? Thank you. Yeah, come on. Drop that good old grocery off. Come on, let's do that. It works. It works well. It works well. But steak and potatoes is definitely go to. I would say if you're gonna do a green to stay in a budget range. Some people don't like this green, but I'm gonna say it anyway. Me, I prefer Brussels sprouts. Love Brussels sprouts. You Brussels sprouts, get Brussels sprouts. Love. Listen, you get them in a little pack, they're like 365 for the pack. For nah, the the Aldi, Aldi. Nah, them right there, see, I see. Aldi, great. A little brand lot, uh-huh. but they be having everything. They can't go wrong with it. And it's a dollar, I think it was like a dollar sixty something last night. I went to get a bag of shredded cheese on Instacart and I was like, I need cheese, I need this, I need that. And something clicked out. And the same cheese I was going to pay eight dollars for, I'll do this. Don't even know what you're missing. Don't, they're right there. They're right there. Yeah, they're right there. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Budget friendly steak and potato. Yes. There you go. And some Brussels. Or chicken. You can do chicken too. Chicken and chicken. Listen, you can chicken breast, but you see people be dry chicken breast. That's what I'm saying. Chicken breast can go wrong so fast. Yeah. Just don't kill your food. <laughs> it's already dead. It's already dead. It's already dead. Yeah, but it's like, listen, to me, food is life. It's like, it's alive, but it's in front of you. Even though yeah. it's dead, it's gone. It's like, but it's mm-hmm. alive, you know what I'm saying? It brings people like a lively joy. So it's right. like, don't kill the food, please. Like, don't do that. Well, if the student, not even the meat, you're talking to yourself. <laughs> we have the same stuff. Save your you know like, Okay, great. That was the budget friendly ver- version, right? Gotcha. Now say tax time just hit. <laughs> oh, yeah. And I want to end, ball out for a second. What can I do? You want lamb chops. You want lamb chops. What do we do? Let us do lamb chops. Lamb chops and lobster, the two L's, you know what I'm saying? Put them together. This is but only your own chance. You know what I'm saying? You don't worry about it. Don't play with it. I'm not going to play this over, don't like the punches. You know what I mean? Not only if it's bad. No randoms. But go ahead. <laughs> I'm not going to say I'm not going to say this dude. Sometimes the randoms be using me. Sometimes the randoms be so good. Just sometimes. Okay. All the time. Okay. 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 Got, got it. Got it. It's all the randoms that you deserve it. I know a lot of females that be loving the random guys. They uh-huh. like, go get some, like, yeah. yeah. Okay. You know what I'm saying? But now, nah, uh, lobster and lamb, definitely in that job. What you would like to do is you get a French rack. Oh, another secret for y'all Costco, Instacart, lamb rack is cheaper than anywhere right now. And it's great, too. You just have to cut it yourself. So if you want to learn the techniques of cutting, Go to YouTube. Trust me, YouTube will take you a long way. But yeah, just keep the lamb rack, cut the lamb rack, do what you do. It's the same way you make a steak. Let it rush. Eight minutes again, please. And then just scroll up and do it. You know what I'm saying? What's the side? We still doing the mash? What can, what can we add to the mash? Could, how about some, I got some truffle oil from um, Italy. My friend went to Italy. Would that help? Like that right there. That's that's explosive. You know what I'm saying? Truffle oil from Italy. No man, no man, no man, no man. I got it. Truffle oil is amazing. Okay. I would use the truffle oil in my back too. Though. Okay. You know what I'm saying? I'll use it on the back, not in the back, just to sit on the back. Okay. Technique, technique, people. You know technique. All right, got you know it. Saying? You put after you after you bake the mac when it's baked to a great bake, and then you layer the first layer of cheese. There's a little bit of that truffle oil. You let it all bake and infuse itself. Do not touch it. Please do not touch it. <laughs> Just let it bake. Okay. Let the cheese melt and you'll smell it. I promise you, you'll smell it. You'll smell it. Leave mm-hmm. it alone. And then you serve it. Uh, asparagus is usually people go to when okay. it comes to like fancy. fancy. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Cream spinach is fine. You know? I love cream spinach. But if you make it from scratch, with a little bit of cream cheese. A little bit of Parmesan cheese, 
trust me. It's from scratch, you got people scratch mm-hmm. a small like not even hold up. I say heavy cream. It tastes way better than any restaurant you go to. Uh Oh uh, yeah, the fancy wines, that's it. that's where we're going. That was in and now let's talk dessert. Quick dessert, either way. Oh, see, this is the fatty party, right? Here. This this is the shape we bought. <laughs> love the fluff. Love, love the fluff. That was a rehearse, guys. Love the fluff. Oh, ooh, I, I, mm. I'm like, see, I'm not that great at baking, but if I do, I'm like a apple or cobbler kind of person, like an apple pie or like a piece of cobbler kind of person. Not like cobbler. But if you, if you want my honest opinion for dessert, it'll be my my mama's banana pudding. Like that is crack. Crack. You know what I'm saying? That's that's it right there. I. I'll serve that to anybody. Mm. I swear to you, I will serve that to anybody. Anybody. You can give me the president and I'll be like, yeah, you gotta try this. Really? I swear to you. I got to say it. Even a person that don't like bananas, you can try this. On what occasions do you do you make it? Uh, like I'm, I'm trying to figure out when I can try it. <laughs> <laughs> when do I need to show up? Any big holidays. Okay. Um, or oh, if it's like my family request in my okay. mom. Okay. My mom's busy, so my mom's cook. My dad's a chef. It's kind of like when it comes to family stuff, I just go. Uh-huh. You know what I'm saying? I let everybody eat, and then I, I'm the last to eat. And right my family can tell you, I'm the last. Really? Eat. Uh-huh. I let everybody. Eat. Women and children eat first, then everybody eats, and then whatever's left, I'll eat. I don't care. I don't, I'm not really uh-huh. like. You know what I'm saying? Because when people are used to wanting to come around and eat, I make so. It's okay. Like, okay. You know what I'm saying? But Banana definitely, I'm gonna, uh-huh. yeah. I'm definitely gonna go. I'm definitely gonna go like. Like ice cream. Ice cream. What, what what brand? I mean Haagen Dazs. I mean. Did you just cringe on Haagen Dazs? Alright, so recently I, I, I found out about these Haagen Dazs ice cream bars, which is like vanilla only situation, and I was like, oh, 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 this is decadence. I can't eat too much of this. Um, but I don't even know. Is there any any vanilla like but like a pure vanilla ice cream? Yes. Really I'm very big on, I don't like the artificial stuff. I don't like gumming my stuff. Yeah, like, I don't like to care. Yeah, that's what's going on. Um, but you want my honest view? This, this is the, this is the Jamaican side of me. Excuse me, pause. Great nut ice cream. <laughs> that goes a lot. It does. But yes, anything warm with ice cream, I'll uh-huh. say for dessert. So uh-huh. even if it's like a brownie, I'm not too big on chocolate. Yeah. Unless it's like a creme brulee and then chocolates under the uh, toasted caramel, we straight. Mm-hmm. But other than that, I'm not a chocolate. From your Instagram, you're the king of events, as it seems. Oh, so you you want to share what you got going? And I see you recently. I think it was Bobby Schmurder, right? Yeah. Clap that up! Clap that up! Big things! Big things! I, I received a phone call from them, literally. Uh, Two hours before the event that I was throwing. So I throw parties. Besides food, I throw parties. Um, and I received a phone call and I was like tired. I was just getting off from a nap and they're like, no, we need you to do it. Um, cook for Bobby. I'm like, what Bobby? <laughs> Literally. I'm like, what Bobby? Uh-huh. And he's like, Smurda. And I'm like, okay. When? <laughs> he's like, they're going, to, they're going to their destination. I'm going to tell you where it was at. Mm-hmm. Tonight, I can't be saying. I Even if I was to go tonight, I wouldn't be able to cook nothing, bro. It's 9 o'clock at night. Mm-hmm. You want me to travel three hours out of town to go cook? Like, right. I right. said, but what I'll do is I'll come right after my event. So my event ended at 4, handle business at the club, did leave to 5.30, we left, went to go pick up oxtail, which is they wanted, besides everything else I'm about to tell you. But I had to get oxtail from out here because where we were going, they didn't have it. Okay. And I, I made sure I was on the phone. Like, 5 30 in the morning, I'm on the phone with a butcher shop all the way in. The I was next about town. to say, people, butcher shops, don't sleep on butcher shops anymore. I mean, as a first generation American, uh, what's the name you said? We grew up in butcher, in butcher shops. Like, you get the fat cut off how you want it, you get God. everything sliced how you want it. Listen to me. See this right here? Just, just look at this. Uh-huh. You always want like your meat either cut big, thick. And any West Indian place that cuts your meat, they know that finger. 
I swear to God, they'll give you like, like this, they'll, they'll do it to you. Yes, right? Well, yeah. Anywhere else, you might have to tell them, yeah, it's true. Nah, but what's the response to be like? The, if you're not getting this when you go to the budget, they not what's the need not authentic. Do not get your fucking face right now. Don't do it. Don't put your ass tail there. Don't put your goat there. Don't put nothing there. Just be like, like me and you guys, I'm going down the block. But back to the store. So, 5 30, I'm going to go to the butcher shop. Then I have it. I ended up getting the ass by out there. And then I had to call my sister. I'm going to death, actually, thank you. Save lives. Called her. I'm like, yo, let's go. She was like, yo, I'm not going to work. I'm like, listen. She she went with me the whole trip. She she actually didn't get called in the work because she's okay. the EMT. She didn't get called oh. in the work. Thank you, first so, responder. Thank it you. Him. Uh-huh. It was like everything played. You know what I mean? So she drove we drove out there, and I started off with brunch. They were supposed to get up for brunch at two o'clock. Mm-hmm. Let's just let's just let this be known. Okay, Bobby, got it. Mother got deaf. They're supposed to get up at two o'clock for brunch. Okay, they don't get up before. And I had <laughs> Spe- speaking of two o'clock. Yes, speaking speaking of two o'clock, but I, I said, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so okay. it must be a thing. You know what I'm saying? Two o'clock just might not be the number. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh I started off I had made fried chicken, mm. forty cup of waffles, mm. chocolate chip waffles, mm. eggs. Mm. Um, bacon, sausage, I mean, two types of sausage. I had the whole thing lined up. The whole smell, like everything. Beautifully decorated, everything. Probably should go on like two o'clock comes with Bobby and Roddy. Stay. Three o'clock comes with Bobby and Roddy. Stay. Four o'clock, where's Roddy? Sleep. But where's Bobby? Bobby comes out the room, blood in his mouth, jumps on the chair, start dancing. I'm like, yo, bro, I gotta go get the dinner stuff, bro. Yeah. Can y'all come on? Uh-huh. <laughs> He started laughing, joking. You know, he's, he's a real good personality. They're both really great. Yeah, he seems very vibrant and okay. animated. Uh, who they it. are on camera is who they are love in it. person, which yeah. is amazing because it's like it's an organic film. Right. So I'm, I'm grateful for it. You know what I'm saying? I got shout out there. It's a phone call. You know, my brother. You know what I'm saying? Biggs, okay. That's not true for me because I made it happen. He was on my back. Mm-hmm. And I had to make sure I was there. I was on them. Pause was when each other about just making sure everything was straight. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. That's kind of how I went. It was, it, was, it was a different kind of compliment for me. Okay. Was, the, the people, the, like the love I received from it, I wasn't expecting. Uh huh. So it was like, you people actually. Yeah. I, I was, was like, double me. tap. A double tap. Yeah, name. as you should be. As, as you should be. I'm a big proponent of celebrating your accomplishments, your, your battles along mm-hmm. the way to the war. Like, there's so many ways that, you know, life puts you down, society puts you down, yeah, just absolutely. everything. Like, yeah, celebrate yeah. your wins. You don't know in today's day and age when you will get another yeah. one. Celebrate that. Like last night I went out, uh, just made a little appearance and just to see what's up. And it was like, certain people that were in there, like, you got to come to Bobby. I could have only my Instagram. Yeah. I'm mean, sure, yes, I, I'm the guy who did that. It, it's, it's, it's a different kind of feeling. Like it happened to me in college when my Instagram was a little known. People were like, you're the guy from Instagram. Mm-hmm. And then it went to, you're the guy that throws the party. Mm-hmm. And then it's like, you're the guy that's the chef. Mm-hmm. It's a different feel when people are able to see you right. in the lights that you work at right. or how you are. Right. And they don't know you personally, but they know you as the person at. Right. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And that's fine with me. I'm, mm-hmm. I'm cool. I'll be the chef all day. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I'll be the party. I'll be the guy that you see like today. That's fine. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? As long as you see what I'm doing, I know I'm doing something. And you're, some, you're somebody. You got it. You got it, tiger, right? But we are all somebody, but sometimes you're somebody. It's my first time being in front of the kids, lights uh-huh. and all that. I think I'm doing something, yeah. right? You yes. know what I'm saying? I'm following the right path. There you go. Um, and and we we hit you before we we hit you before because we recognized your mm-hmm. greatness. Girl. Yes, we did. Remember, you took forever. To get back yes. to us. Yes. You know what? We, so we recognize his greatness. It was Instagram. And I was yeah. Like, you know what? You got to shoot me an email. Yeah. But we didn't We didn't have you. You got to put that in link in bio or something. Yeah, I definitely put that up there. First of all, you you the one who cooks for Bobby now. So you, you got to. Get that. Get that. Like people, people think that. Like the DM works. But sometimes it goes to other if you're not. The, and I tell people, I like sometimes that. people on my team, be like, they didn't respond to the book. Sometimes it goes to others. So sometimes sure. I'll go under a picture and I'm like, hey, check your DM or yeah, whatever. Yeah, it's it definitely, is. it definitely shifted to the, yeah. uh, the others category. And then it, it's like two different questions, top of quest 
more requests. Yeah. It was too difficult to show me all the requests. Why not? We, no, we went to the other, but we, we ain't mad. It ain't my fault. I swear. Back to what we were saying. No, 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 no. So glad you got that going on and you did that and you do lavish. Um, I do lavish, and, lavish. Not the lavish um, on America, I believe this is the lavish in Jamaica Avenue. Okay. 211 in Jamaica Avenue. Okay. It's two different ones. Was saying shout out to Comrade for owning the other lavish, but we don't do yeah. we don't that lavish. Mm-hmm. We the other one. Right. But let me shout out to Comrade. He is a black man. He owns his own location. So I'm going to definitely give him right. his, 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 you know, his two to horns for that. You know, but I, I throw a list of the lavish. I've been there every Friday so far. Mm-hmm. It's cool. No, it, it, it doesn't do diligence. It's, it's a whole movie. So Shapely has a number of events coming up and will also be at other people's events. So okay. next month, which will be March, we'll have our big brunch. You know, we might have to... Well, we got the email now, so we don't even have to use the DMs. You know, yeah. we might have to send a little little kite over there somewhere. I'll, 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 um, I'll, I'll, so. I'll, I'll, let's say we have two. I'll do <laughs> both. We yeah. Can, we can both. Yeah. 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 So we're going to do the big, and then we'll be at several events. In Florida, we have the Kirk Ventures Bash. We have Vegas in July. We have Atlanta in August. We have Chicago in October. You can see all the events and the places we'll be at by visiting our events page, shapelyevents.com slash events. There you go. Shape us. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm telling you what. I'm telling you, every time they go out the bloopers, and every time they're gonna see me in the bloopers, what a fit. Watch. <laughs> that closes out our um our Valentine's Day. Like that closes out our Valentine's Day episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um hold out, let them know where they can keep you. She said thank you. I'm gonna say thank you. You know what I'm saying? Y'all tuned in to us. Because it ain't me no more. It's a we. I don't know. I, I, I know we. I know we. But that, that's about it. See that? But that's that's it right there. And just share my pen. Go ahead. <laughs> I just I felt like stuck on them a little bit. But go ahead. All right, all right, all right. Right. Once again, y'all can follow me on Instagram at underscore R U X P I N on my food page, which is Lux Comforts. And the email will be in the bio. We're going to get him right. We're going to get him right. We're going to get him right. But yes, yes. We don't want to show up at Lavish. Like, I sent you a message. <laughs> I do all <laughs> private events from dinners, whether it's two people, four people, 30 people, don't matter. Yeah. I get it done. If you need event spaces, I can get you those as well. Because I do events in the We don't, excuse me. Um, anything, just as a plug, this, anything I do. If I'm traveling, if you want like a photographer, video person, decor person, I travel with the team, and they definitely work with me. So trust me, I, 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 everything I do, black owned, black everything, everybody black. come with me. I'm glad you said that because it's trust also me. Black History Month. That's a fact. Black, black. 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 <laughs> Trust me. Trust me. Yeah, it's also like it's Those are my Instagrams. I don't really do 22, 22 much, but I'm going to get on Twitter again yeah. and continue because no. Twitter has officially turned into porn of Really? That's a whole other conversation. Tell me. We're going to finish that, but you can follow us across all platforms at Shapely Events and don't forget to visit our website, shapelyevents.com. Yeah, make sure you visit them, man. Yeah. That's what's going down. For us. <laughs>